Hi everybody, Miss Sam here, and welcome back to another online dance class. Today, I'm gonna teach you guys how to do some basic tap moves in just under 15 minutes. All ready, so let's grab those tap shoes and let's get started. Alrighty friends, so normally here at the dance studio we do tap class for 45 minutes to an hour long. So this video is not to be used to so just think you can learn tap in under 15 minutes and you're good to go. This is just a quick little refresher to go over some basic tap moves, learn them in a quicker environment and you guys can use them to practice at home. Alrighty, let's get started. So some of our dancers here at the dance studio have a basic tap audition coming up. So I'm going to use this video for them to practice their tap moves at home. So I'm going to go pretty quickly. But if you guys need more help with these, you can rewind this video as many times as you'd like. Alright, so we're going to start out with just a basic shuffle. A shuffle makes two sounds, and a shuffle goes up to the sky. A flap is a basic two sounds too, but that one lands down to the ground. So a shuffle goes front and you pick up that knee, and a flap goes brush down. So shuffle goes brush up, and flap goes brush down. So shuffle goes up to the sky, and flap goes down to the ground. So a shuffle sounds like this, and a flap sounds like this. Both the same sounds, they both make two sounds, but one goes up, and one finishes down. Alrighty, our next move is going to be a drawback. So I like to have our hands right out in front of us. We're just gonna do a simple pull, stop, pull, stop, pull, stop, pull, stop. Let me turn to the side so you guys can see my feet. We go pull, stop, pull, stop, pull, stop, pull, stop. And when we do these across this floor at the dance studio, we like to land up on our toes so we don't get any of our heels in the sound with our drawbacks. So we go, pull, stop, pull, stop, pull, stop, pull, stop. Nice job, friends. Alrighty, so moving on to our buffalo. A buffalo is just gonna be a basic four sounds. We're gonna do a leap, shuffle, leap. Leap, shuffle, leap. Leap, shuffle, leap. And leap, shuffle, leap. Good job, let's try it on the left. We go, leap, shuffle, leap. Leap, Shuffle, leap. Leap, shuffle, leap. And leap, shuffle, leap. Nice job, friends. Next move is going to be a maxi four. It's kind of like a buffalo, but it adds an extra few sounds. So we're going to do our leap, shuffle, leap. Tap that toe behind you. And leap, shuffle, leap. Tap that toe behind you. That's all it adds. Let's try it on the left. Ready? So we go leap, shuffle, leap. and you can do these on the right or the left. So our cramp roll goes toe, toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, heel, heel. Now let's try it with the left toe starting first. Toe, toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, heel, heel. And all said and done, it's gonna sound like this. Just like a horse galloping. All right, so. If you see me keep looking down, that's because I've got a list right below my camera. Our next move is our Irish. So our Irish is just a simple shuffle, hop, step, shuffle, hop, step, shuffle, hop, step. So breaking it down, it's our shuffle like we learned earlier, a shuffle. We do a basic hop, step, and you're going to switch. Shuffle, hop, step, shuffle, hop, step, shuffle, hop, step. And it sounds like this all together. Shuffle, hop, step, shuffle, hop, step. Nice job, friends. Alrighty, our next move is going to be a waltz clog. So a waltz clog is pretty simple. It just sounds a little bit more crazier than it is. We're going to do a step on our right foot. We're going to go shuffle, ball, change. And then you'll switch to the left. Step, shuffle, ball, change. Step, shuffle, ball, change. Clog. Alrighty, moving on to our Shirley Temple. I would say 
this and one other one is probably the trickiest one on the list, but you'll get it in no time. So, our Shirley Temple goes flat. Now you're gonna drop your opposite heel that you just flapped on, heel, heel. Then we're gonna go pull, heel, tap your toe, heel. So again, that goes flat. Heel, heel, pull, heel, tap your toe, and another heel. Let's try it to the left. Flat. Heel, heel, pull, heel. except we're doing a pullback instead of a shuffle. So we're going to go step, pull, ball, change. Step, pull, ball, change. Step, pull, ball, change. Step, pull, ball, change. Nice job. So similar to our waltz clock. And step, pull. Nice job, friends. Alrighty, so moving on to our Cincinnati's. These are one of my favorite tap moves. I prefer the double Cincinnati's, but we're going to do the single today. So a single goes pull, heel, shuffle, tap. Pull, heel, shuffle, tap. So let me do it face in the back so you guys can see it a little better. We're going to pull our right foot. We drop our heel. We shuffle to the side and tap your toe. Now we're going to go on the other side. Pull, heel, shuffle, tap. To make it a double, you would go pull. Nice job, friends. Alrighty, moving on to our single, double, triple time steps. These are probably the trickiest on the list, but if you practice them, you'll have them in no time. So, we're going to start with our single. We go hop, step. That's the most important part, that you switch your knee. Hop, step, flat. Now we're going to step ball, change. Now that foot that we just finished stepping on, we're going to pick that foot up. So we go hop, step. Switch that knee, flat, ball, change, hop, step, flat, ball, change, one more, hop, step, flat, ball, change. Now to make it a double, we're going to add an extra flat. So we go hop, flat, switch that knee, flat, ball, change, and hop, flat, switch that knee, flat. start. If I see any dancers at the audition starting on their heels, well, that's not going to be a check mark for that one. So make sure that you don't get used to starting on your heels. But if you're just learning it, it sometimes helps out. So we start up on our toes and we go. Good job. Make sure you lift up so you get that air. And nice job, friends. All right. The next move is a wing. I would consider this one of the trickiest ones. They're just kind of harder to get. 
So a wing is when we brush our foot out and we go pull top. Out, pull top. Out, pull top. Let's try it on the other side. Out, pull top. Out, pull top. Out, pull top. Nice job. So something that helps our students out with wings here is I have somebody sit in a chair and I have the person who's tapping stand behind it and hold on to the arms of the chair. They're then gonna prep and push all their body weight up onto the chair so they can use both feet to brush those feet out and in. So if you'd like to try that at home, I recommend that. We also have a wings tutorial on our YouTube that you can use for a little bit extra practice. But let's try four of them today. I'll try and do them in slow motion, but I don't think that's gonna work out. Here we go, ready? Five, six, seven, eight, and ten. Nice job, friends. Alrighty, our last move is a toe tip. So, a toe tip is pretty simple, especially for all my dancers who do point. We're just gonna prep just like we did for our wings, so up on those toes, and we're just gonna go toe tip and dip, and land back on those toes. So going to the side so you can see it a little better, we just go prep on your toes, toe tip, and back on those toes. So if you were to do four of them, it would sound like this. Nice job, friends. Alrighty, so that was it for our list for the audition. So you guys just learned some basic tap moves in under 15 minutes. I am so proud of you. You guys can use this video as many times as you'd like to practice all of these basic tap moves. Now remember, like we said earlier, this video is not to be used to become a tap dancer. You will need some extra practice for that and sometimes it may take a few weeks to get some of these moves. This is just me going over it quickly for our friends here at the dance studio who have an audition coming up and for anybody who would like a little refresher on these moves. But we do have some in-depth tap videos on our YouTube channel that you guys can check out as well. Alrighty, you guys did an amazing job today. Thank you for dancing with me. Keep on dancing. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye guys!